Okay, so today um, I want to see if I can put some kickstand things on here. Kickstand, so there it Play spring feet. So I'm gonna go find some bar and I want to attach it somewhere in this area, bring it out and have some place for your foot. So let me go see what I can find. And uh, yeah, it's not gonna be in this video, but uh, I did take this thing out and it actually rides pretty good, but uh, I'm waiting on the throttle cable. I'm just doing it all by reaching around. And I'm also waiting on the rear brake because uh, the front brake works okay um, for what it is, but you really do kind of need a rear brake. Um, so the torque converter I had to grease up. I put all the grease in there and uh, it actually works pretty good. So um, I think this thing's going to be fun the way it is. Um, and if we decide we want more top speed out of it, we'll switch the gears. But uh, it's got a lot of power, and it's a lot of fun. So I'm going to go look for some metal, and I'll be back with the welder. Okay, so I cut some pieces. Um, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to attack this something like that, give or take. And then I'm going to decide how I want to put the bottom piece on. I think in something like this. Might do it on an angle, but um, I'm planning on neatening this up a little bit after the fact. So first thing I'm gonna do is tack it straight on, something like that. Might do it right there. So what you're going to see here is uh, it took a lot of trial and error to get these foot pegs in the correct place. Um, you really need to sit on it and decide which way is best for you. Um, I did it based on where the seat was. I ended up, you know, making it so it was a little further back because I knew I was moving the seat back. So uh, a lot of adjustment here. It, it took a little while to get it right um, and I was just doing little tiny welds so that way I could snap it off. and get the correct position and then I could do the final welds. I think that's going to be the final position for this. Um, I'm just going to weld that little line right there and then we'll worry about cleaning up the mess I made afterwards and we'll do the other side. This actually was pretty good so I'm not too upset about this. I got a little bit of play in them but if that really bugs me after I, I'm going to like round these off or something. But the play bothers me afterwards. <laughs> Shouldn't be going that far to the hip there anyway. But, um, if the play bothers me, I will uh, put something on the inside of this.
down, I'm going to, um, I'm going to round off the edges probably and take off this edge because you don't want to really walk into any of this. Um, yeah, in general, clean up these welds. And from there, we need to do the accelerator cable and uh, the rear brake. And then this thing's pretty much done after it. I mean, we'll have to paint it, but we might want to stiffen it up a little bit because there's a lot of flex in the frame, but it's driving pretty good. You can see I've been running around the property. Not perfect, but it works. Torque converter works pretty good too. So yeah, like I said, I'm gonna come back through with a sanding wheel and I'll clean up all that stuff. I might want to strengthen it a little bit because it does have a lot of twist, but I don't think that's a bad thing to be honest with you. But anyway, it's good first start. So think real quick before I go. I'm going to take off these corners because I know I'm going to catch myself on that. And, uh, yeah. We'll see you in the next one.